Hello, and welcome to this tutorial for installing Modern Mobile Suite for Microsoft Dynamics RMS. This video will walk through the download, installation, and configuration of MMS on your system. To start, you will need to download the MMS installer. The latest build of MMS is always available on the New West Technologies website. Just go to newwesttech.com and select Downloads. After filling out a brief form, you will find a list of available programs to download. Locate Modern Mobile Suite for Microsoft Retail Management System and select Download Now. If possible, we always recommend saving to a folder on the C drive. Once the download is finished, navigate to the folder and you will find a zip file MMS for MMS. Go ahead and extract those files. Once finished, open the new folder, and on the MMS for RMS, right-click on the installer and select Run as Administrator. From here, you can walk through the installation by selecting Next when available. Once this section of the installation is completed, select Next, and here you will see the URL that you can go to from any device with a modern browser to get to your modern mobile suite interface. In this case, it's going to be https colon slash slash your computer's host name colon 4443. You can also substitute the host name with an IP address of the computer running the modern mobile suite service. If you click Next, you'll have come to the final screen in the installation, and here you have the option to launch Modern Mobile Suite and configure it. We'll go ahead and do that now. You can see the little wave icon down here. This is now the Modern Mobile Suite service running on this computer. Now, the first time that you log on to Modern Mobile Suite from any device, you are going to get a similar warning to the site is not secure or the web page cannot be loaded. And this is a safety feature built into modern web browsers to ensure safety for web traffic. Since this is a locally hosted service, it's not something we have to worry about. So go ahead and hit details or advanced or whatever it says there and proceed to the web page. So this is where you're going to enter the SQL credentials, just like you would for setting up RMS. So here's going to be your computer name the port, the name of the database, username for SQL, and the password. If you do have an encrypted connection, this is where you would add that. If you don't have an encrypted connection or don't know what it is, you probably don't have one, so it's safe to go on to the next option. Let's go ahead and hit save. Once the database has successfully connected, this is where we will set up the initial configuration for MMS. The first step is to set a password for access to the modern mobile suite system. This is going to be different from the password you use to access RMS. Here, there are going to be two different passwords that are distinguished by whether or not a user has manager or administrator credentials in the RMS manager program, or if they're just a basic user. For people with manager credentials, they will use this elevated password. And for people with basic credentials, they will use this basic password. The passwords can be whatever you want them to be. They just cannot be blank and the basic and elevated passwords cannot match. Next, if your store is running as part of an HQ environment, go ahead and select this so it writes to the database correctly. In this case, it does not. And then here is some suggested buy options for the purchase orders. For more questions on this, you can refer to the user guide. For now, we'll just leave this as default. And then this quick receive all gives an option for orders that come in to have a receive all button come off. If this is not enabled, you'll have to go through and select each item individually on a PO. 
and you can, as well you can also require a signature capture. When you do receive an order, a screen will pop up to have somebody sign on that screen. Here we'll just go next. And Modern Mobile Suite has been installed and configured. From here this is going to be your standard login page for whatever device that you sign into. And once you sign on, you will see any POs that you have already existing in your system, and this is going to be the landing page. If you've received a username and password in order to license your copy, go ahead and click the follow this link to license your copy, which will take you to the registration page. Your username is going to be the email that you provided, and then the password that was sent to you. Go ahead and select license. Now it will show how long this program is licensed through. To get back to the home page, select the menu and see lists. And this brings you back to the home page. Now we can test signing in from any device that's on your network. We'll go ahead and sign out from this here. To open Modern Mobile Suite on any device that is on the same network as this computer hosting MMS, go ahead and open a web browser. We'll go to https colon slash slash and this will be the host name or IP address of your computer. It's mms-rms colon four 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 three. As Sandra, you'll get the security warning. Go ahead and just proceed, and you will be able to log on to Modern Mobile Suite. Thank you for joining us on this tutorial of Modern Mobile Suite for RMS. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out to New West Technologies.